Alright guys, so today I'm going to show you how to increase FPS in Grand Theft Auto 5 for PC. Uh, first, let's see. This uh, Reddit user, Goftree, uh, basically posts how his CPU is at 100% and yada yada. Uh, how low are your CPU usage? Um, and he says, Grand Theft Auto 5 launcher was uh, just sat there eating up 25% of his uh, CPU usage. Uh, so if you just alt tab out of your Guns of Auto 5, open task manager and and end the Guns of Auto 5 launcher process, it'll increase your FPS. Um, here is a batch uh, is text that will automatically close the launcher for you after 60 seconds of launching the game. So let's show you how to do that. So if we go new text document, open it up, we take these files, or this, not files, uh, text, copy it, throw it into here, and save it, rename it to GTA 5, and rename text to bat, create a second one, so now if we open it, It's actually closed. I will, I'm going to show you the uh, frame difference next, but that will automatically close it for you. Uh, and then I'm going to show you the frame difference that I get. It'll say in the top right. I think it goes on from around a normal 40 FPS to a uh, 60 FPS. Um, I am recording my screen right now, not the game, so it will look laggy for you. But as you can see in the top, it isn't actually that laggy. It is right now. But once I'm in game, it'll look like it's at like 5 FPS, but it says 40 or 60. So I don't see the lag, but you might, because I'm not actually recording just the game. So it might look shitty for you, but it looks fine for me. And you can see the frame difference. So. Alright, game's on. Story mode. Uh, sorry about my sick voice, I am currently sick, I've been sick for almost a week, and my nose is stuffy, and I have a cough, so my voice sounds really shitty right now, and you might hear some heavy breathing, it's mostly just from bringing up my mouth, because I can't breathe out of my nose, so okay, we're at 40 FPS, 45 FPS, which isn't bad, it's still better than consoles at 30 FPS, but uh, it's not what I want, I want 60 FPS, so if we pause the game, Open up Task Manager. We then find Grand Theft Auto 5 Launcher and the process. If we go back into the game, I'm now at 50, 53, 54. So it does increase your FPS. It does still kind of stutter. But it will increase your FPS. I noticed when I was not recording, I was hitting 60 FPS and I was driving down the street with Franklin really fast. Um, so if I'm not recording, it usually does just make the game better. Um, it probably does look laggy for you right now, but it isn't for me. I see 50 FPS. So driving. Let's see a Franklin. It might be because I'm recording that my frames aren't as high as they were when I wasn't. Cause I did play this game without recording, and it was at it was 60, and it dropped maybe 50, maybe. But right there, I just went to 31. I think it's because I'm recording. I think I'm gonna pause the recording and see the difference. Let's see. All right, so I can confirm it is because I'm recording. Um, I was at 60 FPS when I wasn't recording, 
So, uh, so that's a positive. Um, it also, your CPU, as you can see up here, it might completely destroy your CPU. It might just run at 100% um, constantly, like it is for me. But if you close the thing, it will hopefully reduce the usage. It doesn't for me, sadly, but people on Reddit have said it does. So, yeah. Hope this helps you.